Good morning and welcome to day 26 of May Vlogs. Not long to go now. You join me again with wet scraggly hair. <clears throat> um, it is Monday morning. Today is technically a bank holiday but Tom has to work. Um, although Arthur would, would have still been off school today so we are having a day off. <clears throat> I've got a frog in my throat apparently this morning. Um, well he's having a day off. I have got loads to do and you know when you just get that feeling that there's just too much to do. Um, I need to get today's vlog edited. Well, the one I recorded yesterday that's going up today. Um, I've sat and done that this morning. So that's now exporting, hopefully. But it will then need to get uploaded to YouTube as well. Right, let's see if I can find some tea to get rid of this frog in my throat, shall we? Um, oh, so much bird and blend tea, but there's not really any black tea in there at the moment. And I do need a little bit of caffeine this morning. Hmm, what's we got in here? Ah, oh, that's Tom's chamomile one. Some Earl Grey. I don't think if we open these ones, maybe I could have one of those ones. What have I got in here? Let's have a little look, shall we? More bird and blend, cinnamon, apple and cinnamon, chai, peppermint. Oh, there's some Earl Grey there. We've run out of Earl Grey. I drink Earl Grey tea just as my normal tea. I don't really drink breakfast tea. Um, and we've run out. Um, but obviously, I've got a couple of spare bags. I think that might be what I have to have. PG tips. Goodness knows what that is. Yep, I think that's a winner. Going to go boring and plain, and I'm going to stick with some Earl Grey. <laughs> We've lost one child to the cold. Arthur was absolutely loving it. I don't think I have seen him have that much fun in weeks, to be honest. He really enjoyed being in there, um, but he's really skinny. <laughs> so he's got really cold really quickly, despite us adding um, multiple buckets of hot water into the paddling pool as well. Um, so he has gone inside to get himself dried and dressed um, and I think he's just going to put some cosy, he wants me to cosy up on the sofa with him. So we're going to do that in a little bit, but at the moment Jasper is still in the paddling pool. Which 
Are you cold, Jasper? We're all having a bit of a warm up on the sofa. Arthur's playing some Lego City, and I'm still trying to add this square to this blanket. <laughs> you say hello, boys? Uh, no? Punch your stuff down. We've had an influx of birds in the garden. <laughs> There's obviously something in the grass that they're after. Never seen so many of them. Right, the last of the yarn is just finishing off. It just needs to set. Um, and then I can get it out and give it a soak and that's all good. Um, what else? The May vlog is up. The podcast still has 55 minutes apparently. But it's, it's getting there and that's going up onto YouTube. Um, yeah, I'm getting there with all the things I need to do today. Um, although we're having quite a good day, um, Arthur is in a lovely mood. He's really tired, but he's in a lovely mood. He really enjoyed the paddling pool this morning, so that was really good. Um, Jasper is enjoying lots of snuggles. So we seem to be spending most of the day in between um, adding batches of dye to my yarn and all the other little bits and pieces that I need to do. We seem to be spending most of the day on the sofa, which is quite nice. I have nearly, nearly finished. I am half a pattern repeat away from finishing the um, foot of the second sock with my sex sock nest socks. So hopefully I might get those finished today. If I can get two toes knit this evening, we'll see, fingers crossed, but they are very, very close to being finished. Right, it's half past three. Tom is downstairs with the boys and I have come up to my office to get some mini skeins wound. That is my plan, I think. Um, I'm going to leave the Wool Monty video stuff for another day. I need to get my head around what I want to record and stuff like that. Not really sure. Um, but yeah, I need to get these mini skeins wound. I'm going to pop on an episode of Casualty and get winding. Lots and lots of mini skeins. These are all um, the Cornwall mini skeins. Well, these aren't. These are skeins of Kynance. <laughs> but the rest of these are the Cornwall mini skeins, all ready for the next shop update, hopefully. Tom is in the process of organising our hall cupboard. We have a wine order coming tomorrow. Um, Mostly because we've got fed up of the fact that we can't buy wine before 10am and I'm not going shopping after 10am because the supermarkets are too busy. Um, so we have ordered some wine. So he's just sorted out our hideous hall understairs cupboard thing and put our wine rack in ready for lots of bottles to fill it up tomorrow. Good evening. I feel like I've not filmed much today. So apologies if there's not a lot to share with you. Um... It's been a good day though actually we've been, yeah it's been a good day I got my yarn dyed I couldn't really share much of that with you because I'm dyeing the club yarn so it would all have to be black and white anyway um the boys have had a really good day they really enjoyed the paddling pool this morning um and then we've just had a quiet day of kind of playing games and stuff like that sitting on the sofa together really um Tom came down at about three and gave me a chance to get some work done. So I managed to get loads and loads of minis wound ahead of the shop update. And I even managed to get started on winding some of the nostalgia minis that we'd, I dyed last week. Um, yeah, good day. The boys are in bed. Well, they're in their bedroom. Um, I'm going to go up and turn their light out in a minute and try and convince them to go to sleep. Um, and then my evening is going to be spent finishing these socks um, this one is ready for a toe and this one is ready to be kitchened. Um, so that is my plan this evening. These will be finished before I go to bed tonight, finally. It really does feel like these socks have dragged. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, they will be finished tonight and that will be a huge cause for celebration. <laughs> Look 
what I finished. It's about half past ten. <laughs> but I got them finished and they're going to go in for a quick soak so that I can put them on the sock blockers. I don't normally block socks, um, but with the lace and cable pattern, I think these will benefit from a quick block. So I'm just putting them in to soak. There we go, one freshly finished pair of socks on the radiator, on the sock blockers. Hopefully they'll be dry by the morning, although they are still quite damp, so they might take a bit longer than that to dry. And don't judge me for the fact that the socks that I washed the other day are still on the airing, <laughs> are still hanging up. They're all dry, they've been dry for a few days. I have just failed to throw them away. Also, I don't quite know why there is a tissue box on the floor. I blame a child. 